Celebrities are in the public eye. They're always under pressure to look perfect. And more often than not, their appearance is altered. But the problem comes in when uh, you can tell that their appearance is altered. And it's usually through a Photoshop fail. I'm about to count down the top 10 celebrity Photoshop fails you can't unsee here for you on IO. Hey, 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 welcome back to Inform Overload. I'm Charlotte Dobre. On this channel, we do the news, we make it entertaining, and we also expose the fakeness of social media. I'm Charlotte Dobre. Did I say that? I don't remember. Please subscribe. <laughs> And follow us on social media. Starting off our list at number 10, we have Priyanka Chopra. Priyanka's beautiful goddess self was on the cover of Maxim back in 2016. But whoever photoshopped this completely got rid of her armpit. <laughs> like it's just gone. There's no texture or shadows to indicate that there's an armpit there. It's just skin. I don't know what it is about armpits, but women just like aren't allowed to have hair or any sort of discoloration there. The entire world would like to pretend that women don't grow hair there. And guess what? We do. And trust me, it grows fast. Kind of depends on the person, but usually it's like within a day or half a day. It grows back just about as fast as your stubble grows back, fellas. But no, we need to pretend it doesn't exist. I can totally picture whoever was behind this magazine cover being like, yeah, she looks good, she looks good, but like, she has an armpit, man. Just get rid of it. I don't like armpits. <laughs> Can't disappoint our fan base, can we? Priyanka actually joked about this on Twitter and said, here's another pit stopping picture to add to the debate. Will the real armpit please stand up? No filter, armpit diaries. This isn't the only magazine Photoshop fail on this list. There's quite a few of them, so keep watching. Are you watching still? Are you watching? In at number nine, we have Selena Gomez. In January of 2017, celebrity makeup artist Huang Van Gogh posted this photo of Selena Gomez after he was finished working on her. All you notice at first is how unspeakably gorgeous she is. Like, honestly, it should be illegal to be that good looking. But if you look to the, like, the left over there, where the door is, oh yeah, you see that. The wall and the door is warped either to make Selena's shoulder lower or to give her hair a little bit more volume, which is, I guess, kind of harmless. It's not like he altered Selena's waist without her permission, but now that you've seen this Photoshop fail, you can't unsee it, can you? That's why it's, that's the title. In number eight, we have Gwyneth Paltrow. In March of 2012, Gwyneth Paltrow appeared on both the cover and in the pages of Harper's Bazaar. The cover actually turned out great. It was the editorial photos that went horribly wrong, and that's probably because Terry Richardson took them. <gasps> this photo looks kinda odd, doesn't it? Either she's pulling the back of her hem of the dress around the front leg of her body or the whole lower half of her body is edited. You can really see that there's something off when you look at the other photos that were in succession. Like this dress should not be doing those things. Or maybe it was doing those things and one of her legs is actually like a wide pant leg. I don't know man, but it looks really weird. <laughs> at number seven on our list we got Adam Levine. In 2011, Adam Levine posed with girlfriend at the time and V for Vogue Russia. It's all good. It's all good and looks great and so does her butt. But her butt did not look good enough to distract from the rest of the photo, mainly Adam Levine's torso. Either Adam Levine's waist is about 10 inches or there's literally half of it missing from this photo. I know why they did it too. He probably had like a little bit of squishy. You know a little squishy that shows up when you sit like this? Yeah, you get a little squishy there. Come on, I know you get a squishy, I get it. So Adam Levine probably had a little bit of squishy going on there. And then it was probably too difficult to Photoshop out with the shadow being there, because Anne's leg was in front of it, so they just copy and pasted the gray background. But it looks weird as hell now that you've noticed, isn't it? In at six, we have Kate Moss. Back in 2011, Kate Moss and her daughter posed for a September issue of Vogue. This photo was actually the main photo for the entire September issue, and if you know about September issues of Vogue, they're one of the most important issues of the year, which is why it's that much more embarrassing. Whoever photoshopped this photo completely got rid of several of Leela Grace's fingers. She's straight up missing her pinky, her ring finger, and some of her middle finger. I don't really know the motivation behind getting rid of some of those fingers. Maybe the intention was to make Kate Moss look thinner. But like this was Kate Moss in 2011. She was already like blowing away whenever the door would open. So it's a family guy joke. Come on. You know the family guy joke? She blows away when, the, when there's a draft. At number five, we have Avril Lavigne. Avril was on the cover of Maxim a few times, but this cover was iconic. Not because Avril looks amazing, but because her elbow looks weird. Whoever photoshopped this picture made her elbow look jagged and like skeletal. And what's worse is this was a cover. It's never going away. That was in print. So why did Maxim do this? Well, they probably wanted to make her arms a lot skinnier and her body a lot curvier so she looked more hourglass. I mean, this is a Maxim cover we're talking about. They do love their curvy cover girls. 
must be bigger, waist must be smaller. At number four, we have Lindsay Lohan. Back in 2015, Lindsay posted this photo of herself to Instagram with the caption, my feet look red, lol, had to take that out. Only real red is my hair. Maybe Lindsay thought talking about her feet and her hair would divert attention away from her thighs and the door. But this has to be one of the most obvious uses of editing apps I've ever seen. Look at her butt! Look at the door! <laughs> Based on how she's moved around the pixels, it kind of looks like she wanted to make her butt look bigger and her thighs look smaller. Like it's so bad and people were quick to notice. The comment section was filled with ha ha ha's and honestly that does not surprise me. <laughs> Three, we got Chrissy Teigen. In 2014, Chrissy Teigen graced the cover of Mexican GQ wearing nothing but a pair of blue undies. Now I completely understand why Chrissy Teigen's nips were cut out of this photo. This is the cover of GQ after all. This isn't Playboy guys. They ain't gonna put no nips on that cover. But why wouldn't they have just chosen a different photo? Cause this photo is weird. Like I want to see a nipple there, but I also don't want to see a nipple there, you know? I know based on where her arm is that there would be a nipple there if it weren't for the Photoshop, but it still looks really weird because there is no nipple there. Do you see what I mean? And now all I can think about is Chrissy Teigen's nipples, which isn't the worst thing to think about. In at two, we have Dowson Crows. Vogue magazine likes to chop off limbs, fingers, toes, legs. Like that time back in 2012 when Vogue China chopped off Dutch supermodel Doutson Crow's right leg for an editorial shoot. Where is her other leg? Also it kind of looks like she also doesn't have a right arm either. Vogue chopped off her right leg and arm. Doutson actually responds to this photoshop flub. She told the post at the time, I just saw this, maybe it's two legs together? Oh yeah maybe. Maybe it's the pose? I was like, oh my god, I think photoshopping is okay until something like that happens. You don't want to lose one of your limbs. Yeah, you sure don't. That would be really problematic, losing a limb. And at number one, we have Kim Kardashian. Are you really surprised? This photo of Kanye West taking a photo of his wife Kim Kardashian and daughter North while Kim is also taking a selfie is pretty much the most millennial thing ever. Everything looks normal, right? Wrong. If you look in the background, the room this photo was taken in has a wall of mirrors. So then, where's Kanye's reflection? I had my suspicions, but they are now confirmed. Kanye West is a vampire. And this photo was in American Vogue magazine too, one of the most renowned fashion magazines in the world. How did they not think people would notice this? Maybe they did it on purpose. I can see the picture Anna Wintour being like, Mm, yes, Kanye's reflection is looking a little fat. Get rid of it. Okay, guys, there you have it. Which one of these Photoshop fails resonated with you the most? Let me know down in the comments. For now, I'm gonna wrap up this one with some comment features. Batman Fan Forever said, That was a good video. I liked it. You're awesome. <sighs> You're so nice. You're always so nice. I haven't featured your comments in a while, Batman Fan Forever, so here you go. Thank you for being such a loyal fan. Batman Fan Forever is about as loyal as a fan can get to both IO and, and Batman. <laughs> you should change your name to IO Fan Forever. Ah! Mm -mm. Kayla Belt said, Char, is your lip okay? I don't know. I'll ask her. Are you okay? She says she's okay. Thanks for asking. Maddie said, I'm a stay at home mammy, so I'm usually at home with a toddler running around driving me crazy, and IO helps break up the boredom and frustration from the day. Thanks, Charlotte, and everyone at IO. You're welcome. Take a nice little bath. Take care of yourself. That's it for me. Thanks for watching. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want more, and I will see you next time. Go back. I need to go back. I need to go back a little bit. <laughs> I'm waiting for the teleprompter. That's a big gap. That's, That's a big gap in the teleprompter. Because Anne's leg was behind. We're gonna try this again. Okay? Just one more time. Behind the front. Be in front. Honey. Weird.